Underneath me is three giant holes and me and the boys have to convert them into underground bases. Tell me how do you get in? Oh, oh, ah! I found the entrance! Oh, and also, we only have three days to pull this off. First time stepping in the hole, boys. This is where I have to build my secret laboratory. Let's take a look at this hole. So a movie theater, huh? I got some ideas. Now, how do we turn a hole in the ground into a Lego bedroom? I introduce you to the lab. It's the plan. When I think of a laboratory, I think of white walls, clean, everything looks nice. How big of a TV you think will fit on that wall? Like an 85 inch, right? I think I'm gonna put bed over there. Maybe mini fridge right here. All right, so this is gonna be the fridge. It's gonna be right here. Ooh, couch for the boys or a recliner for the man? Put some Legos on the wall right here. Maybe some Legos on the ceiling. Oh, that's sketchy. Just watch your head. <laughs> this is kind of what I'm going for, you know? So you have like the rock there, which is right here. Do you know how to do all that? We're about to figure it out. Movie theater is pretty simple enough. Couch, TV, speakers, Xbox, decorations. Ah, we got this. All right, we're here. I have no idea what I'm looking for. You know you're at Target when you see the big red walls outside. <laughs> Let's go in. <laughs> Time to spend thousands of dollars to perfect our bunkers. Watch till the end of the video to see what happens when we invite a bunch of kids to judge our bunkers and the loser gets punished. Well, I'm looking for something that's gonna shake the dust off the wall. It, it's gonna be in a hole in the ground. So like it's like a bedroom. Basement or? Yeah, just dirt. Or it's going into the ground? Yeah. This is exactly what I was looking for. See, if we buy two of these and we put it between that butcher block, we have just made an entire kitchen. All right, time to buy a TV. We're getting a big one, that's all I know. So we'd have that much room? Yeah, it'll be all right. I'll play Minecraft, I know what I'm doing. 75 inch for 600 bucks? Hey, that's good. Trying to get the fridge, bro? Ready? We're in this. I wanted something a little crazier, but I don't want to go drive around for 17 hours. I need help building a Lego bunker. Actually, can you push the cart? I want to ride on it. Don't hit the guy. Don't flip us either. It's because you don't have your Crocs in sport mode. That's why you're struggling, Trent. What if you covered the entire ceiling with lights and just look like a bat cave? I don't hit the gym for nothing. Let's freaking go. So we get a big one and a small one. Rainbow worms, throw them in. Blue and purple, throw them in. I didn't even have to do anything. This kid's doing it all for me. We're about to make a freaking Batman cave. Come on, it's a little tight. I know. Oh! <laughs> Let's get out of here. All the shopping's done, but then I realized we needed one last thing. Our base can't be complete without the freaking juice blocks, boys. We're just gonna buy all of it. And we got an apple juicer. Now we just need apples. We're back to the hole, but I figured before we start installing everything, it'd probably be smart to do the lighting first. These are not some plug and play lights. So Mike, you think you can wire these up? Yeah, it wouldn't be hard. So he's gonna connect some stuff to these. We're gonna plug them in. And I'm gonna be Batman. <laughs> Look at this wiring job. Wait, yo Mike. Yes, sir. Is this an extension cord? Yeah, it's an extension cord. <laughs> <laughs> Time to put Legos in the bunker. Welcome back to the mine shaft, mate. We're gonna start digging some holes so we can put the Legos in the hole. Oh, we gonna break this TV before it even gets in the hole. I got it, good. Right here. All right, I feel like the hardest part is done out of this whole base. The TV is in the hole. Mike, plug it in. Oh! Yo, this looks sick. Bro, I can see every detail. All right, it's time to get to work. All right, you ready, bro? Oh, oh, oh ow, my knees! Sorry! I didn't think it'd be that hard to build something underground. Those uh, primitive survival guys make it look like a piece of cake. So what we're digging is the spot where the refrigerator is gonna sit. It's time to dig. It's gonna get dirty. We kept digging and I felt like we were making great progress. But little did we know, this is a lot more difficult than we thought. It's straight rock. I'm digging to China. Cold air comes out right here. So I'll see if I put a fan here. Perfect. Oh, dude, that's a nice fit. Would you look at that? We got a cabinet. This TV, I hope it turns on after all it's been through. Imagine we plug it in and it just doesn't work. 
Welcome to the Lego Fort, everyone. If you look behind you, this is what we've been working on. We got Legos in the wall. Got some right here for some decoration. We got a bigger wall. Now we'll put some blocks right here. And then right here, this is where our bed's gonna go. So this is what it's gonna look like, but we're not done yet. It's starting to go crazy down here. <laughs> hey, it turns on! Think I can make a shelf? Let's see if it fits. Look at that. Not ideal, but unique. Now you're probably asking yourself, James, what's around your face? You got a tooth fake? No. I hit my head on a, one of these wood and I got a boo-boo. But we back to work, baby. Let's bring in the air mattress. <laughs> Bed. Oh, it fits perfectly. I need to add some decorations and I think we'll be A-OK, -okay, baby. It works. We got TVs. We got the speakers. Yeah. The subwoofers back there. Now I got to figure out where I'm going to sit. Put that there. Give me more room here. I'll put a rug here. Chair right here, right in front of this giant TV. That'd be nice. Fridge. Check. I don't know, man. This place kind of sucks. It's supposed to look like a like a laboratory, and it looks like we're 2% of the way done. Like, we literally just put a table in, that's it. Like, when I think of a laboratory, I think of the wall full of, you know, tubes and all kinds of stuff. What if we had, like, a tank here, and it's green, and it has, like, stuff floating inside of it? What you're seeing right now is literally 5% of what the final project is going to look like. What if there was a secret door underneath here that went all the way straight through to Gabe's movie theater? Day one's a wrap. We got a lot of work to do tomorrow though. So if we dig right under here, you think this entire thing is just gonna cave in? Yes. Change of plans, I guess. So it's the next day, and overnight I was thinking, I want to change some things. I want to replace this fold-out table with an actual entertainment center. So we're going to take everything out, we're going to go to the store, we're going to buy an entertainment center, and we're going to do a lot of digging. Let's get to work. These are my schematics that I just drew up for my base. We're gonna follow that step by step. I'm gonna get a ceiling fan installed in here. Probably like right about here. This was definitely worth it. There's so much more room and it looks so much better. We got the two heads in the wall. We got Stinker and Pooper always watching out. They're like my hidden cameras, but not hidden. We got LED Lego. We have a table to build Legos on. We're gonna grab this whiteboard. <laughs> So it doesn't do that. I went and found a popcorn machine in our storage. So I'm gonna make a giant shelf out of the wall here, big enough for the popcorn machine. Mm, this is our first panel. Let's see if it fits. Oh. Oh yeah, dude. That's a nice fit. Huh? What's up, bro? I was just coming to check it out. It's, it's a vibe. Okay, <laughs> yeah, that's not the only one. I got two man caves. Because you're in like a legit cave. Yeah. Yeah. Why would you put a ceiling fan in here? Bro, I needed fans. Y'all got AC units. Oh, yeah, that hurts. Dude, you have to like crouch so much. Oh, wait a minute. Ah! We are beginning to get all the pieces for our juice laboratory. We're gonna fill this tank with green liquid, maybe have some apples floating around. Then we got our TVs. I think it's gonna fall. So we're digging out a little chunk of the wall here. Gotta fit the fish tank in it. Oh, just enough room. This bedroom turning out pretty nice. Time to get my Lego sheets and blanket. My Lego gumball machine. And I think that's it. Do you think that's good? I mean, yeah. If it fits, it sits. It fits. Oh, yeah. I feel like we're mining for fossils. <sighs> it's right above the fridge, too, so hopefully we'll hold that weight. I got my Lego cup. I got my Lego rug right here. Oh, Lego! For now, tape will hold. TV, RGB strips. Oh yeah, the TV's got a USB. I don't even have to do anything. I'm not sticking it to the TV. No one's ever gonna see it. It just needs to glow. Done. You can't tell. It's, you know, it's fine. These are gonna be the holes where juice is gonna flow out of the earth. Is this how they feel when they mine for oil and diamonds? Solid freaking hole. All right, sweet. These are gonna look sick, bro. We are going to destroy this competition. James, no chance. Gabe, on the other hand, 
I don't know how he's doing. Stop the flashing. I don't want a pair of Bluetooth. Oh, yes. How's that look? Ain't no one gonna have a gumball machine in their bunker. Oh, gotta fill it up. This is how you build Legos down in the Lego bedroom fort, baby. Let's go. Three tubes in, two more to go. That looks honestly pretty cool. Where should the banana go? I'm thinking right here. Why is everything USB? I'm gonna go drink some water. That kind of looks sick. So next we need to hang the lantern, get the juice in here, get the juice in the fridge, draw out our formulas, install some RGB lights, and we'll be done. A new day, a new hole. I forgot a shelf. I gotta have a place to put candy. This dirt is really soft. I thought this was gonna take like 15 minutes. It took 15 seconds. Yep, do that like 50 times and we're good. You know what else is not good? We have a freaking juice leak in our wall. Look at this. This is fixable, but there's one thing that is not fixable right now, and that would be the weather outside. There is currently a storm above us. Okay, so we have this storm right here. This one might pass us. This is not good because we are underground right now. What happens when you're underground and it rains? We're, we can literally lose all our progress. And the kids that are gonna come judge our base are gonna be here tomorrow at 9 a.m. That's in like 11 hours. The best thing we can do is just hope that the rain misses us. And if it does, it's gonna be by a hair, but a tiny hair, not a big hair. Like, like the hair on my head, it doesn't exist. In other words, we're screwed. Not falling down anymore. Time for the most important part of the lab. We gotta write the juice blocks formula. You ready? <laughs> Let's see if I'm still a good artist. It's not too bad. <sighs> Epic gamer moment. It all works. Let's clean up. This is the Juice Blocks secret formula. Your four ingredients are water, apple. This is just vitamin C. It helps fight infections, heals wounds, and keeps your tissue healthy. And it's actually found in all fruits and vegetables. And then the last ingredient we have is natural flavors. Natural flavors must come from plant or animal sources. That equals Juice Blocks, which is available in every single Walmart. So go get your juice. Dude, this is art. These kiddos are gonna be judging us on creativity. It's very sciencey. I like that. It looks. For four days, this is actually really good. Functionality. Oh, it says man case. Would they live here? It's too hot to live here. And of course, the vibe check. What's that to like? The two people with the lowest score gets their base destroyed. I don't know how. We haven't gotten that far yet. I'm winning this no matter what. And so the looks, I mean, for four days, this is actually really good. I also like how it had the gumball machine. For creativity, I'll give it also a four. It's a bedroom, and it's not supposed to function other than sleeping. Why is the fan so low? If I get up in the night, it will chop my head off. I think it gets a five. Five? What do you mean? It's one through five. Oh, okay. All right, yeah, five. Five's great. For looks, I give it a five. Yeah! For looks, I'd give it a three. Oh! Who said that? That was him! That was him! All right! Oh, y'all can also take a flower. I made those flowers for y'all. Oh, just for us? Mm-hmm, just for y'all. No, I didn't. It was for decorations. It's too hot to live here. I'm switching the looks from a five to a four. Why? Because that's what I think. <laughs> Who has a better sense of judgment than a bunch of kids? I gave him a one. You gave him a one? This is my bunker. I can guarantee the highest level of satisfaction. That I got everything so you really want. Really but do they have a ceiling fan? No one has a ceiling fan. Ceiling that is true. No, nobody else has a ceiling fan quite like James's. It will chop my head off. I will say the ants kind of found the candy, so. What? The ants? Yeah, some of the candy is okay though. Oh, dude, there's actually TV! You hear those reactions down there? That's a five star. Bro, I'm giving that a five for creativity. I hear fives. I hear fives happening. Oh! You're playing it? What? Bro! No way! My plan is working. They have AC. I want 
need to live here. I don't care if there's sand all over here. In my mind, James is the best one. I think James was more creative. Oh, it says man cave. It doesn't say girl cave, it says man cave. Oh. It's a man cave, but you guys are girls. Yeah, who cares? Who cares? It makes sense. I already got my scores ready. There's nothing under a three. She's just a hater. It's my opinion, so take it. You know what? No! Oh my God! If you like it so much, you can live in it. All right, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. I just wanna let y'all know before you go into the base, I have worked for the past four days on this and um, I'm screwed. That's all I gotta say. Go ahead, come inside. You trying to sweet talk them? All right, all right, all right. Hold all your thoughts oh, until you get inside. Oh, security cam! I can see myself! Whoa, oh, there's a lot of green and I'm, I'm not liking this. This thing is disgusting. I don't know what that is. What is it? It's a lot of science -y stuff. Open the fridge! Open the fridge? What? Are there juice blocks? Yeah, there is! Open the fridge! What's up? No! Yeah! 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 Wait, wait, wait. Turn off the lights. No way! It's very sciencey. I like I'm that. Gonna, okay, wait. I'm giving this a five. I'm done. Letting all these kids judge was a good idea. Now we're seeing that their math capabilities can add up all the correct numbers. Could you imagine if one of them added it wrong and I was actually the winner, but I wasn't because they didn't add it right. I trust these kids. They got juice blocks. They're getting smarter. They're picking the right brands. Go to Walmart right now and get your juice. We have been told that the results oh boy. are in. This is the moment. The winner is... Nathan! Oh, what? Let's go! It's Nathan! Let's go! I honestly go! think he had the worst bit. Juice blocks! Victorious! Victorious! <laughs> They're really getting it over there. This is nice. Fruit snacks next?